Hey, yo, what up, guys? This is me, Wolfie Flowers, here, and, um, to be honest, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing right now, but I'm just gonna pick random stuff today, and um, I'm just looking through it. Uh, today I'm just gonna watch the HD HD, and, uh, hopefully, you know, what's cool. Wait, wait, wait. Let me read this part. It says, um, are you totally ADD? A attention defected hyper, hyper, uh, hyperactivity disorder is somewhat difficult to diagnose. Why? Well, one thing of symptoms are common problems as everyone faces. They are forgetful, distracted, restless, overwhelmed, and loosely track of things. Oh. Okay, okay. So, before I start playing, I'm just gonna let y'all know that basically, um, uh, me and this boy, we're basically returning it along. Um, pretty much he does have the a ADD. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I saw him one time he was taking a nap, and I saw he's fucking shaking and shit, I don't know if it's that one, but he literally can't sleep at all, and he just trying to sleep, but he can't sleep, so I think that's that one, and he did literally told me he has the hypotheric problems and shit, so comment down below, what is the name of that, I don't know if it's the right ADD, is that it, or if it's the a ADHD, but, um, I know for sure I don't have it, but when it gets, like, um, stressful and shit, I'm just can't sleep much. But other than that, it's gear and glow. Um, anyway, just get that. I do have ADD. I take medication for it, and I am very forgetful when I'm not on it. But what? I've never taken a test like this before. I've taken a legitimate, like, test, and I've been tested for hours and hours, and I did that. But I didn't know he had ADD. Doctors. This is the internet. These are the people that I trust. So let's see, what are the signs? For those of you who don't know what ADHD is, is it's ongoing and impairing when inattention, procrastination, overwhelm, and restlessness are constant frustrating problems that undermine many areas of your life. It's a disorder. This quiz is been approved by mm. two independent ADHD specialists. Two! It will give you a sense of whether or not you have this mindset, but will not replace proper assessment. Well, bullshit to that. Let's take it. I need to I take the test. I just want to try. Quick questions. First, explore nine inattention and focus. Of course, life is rarely black and white. If what we're describing happens to you regularly, then send yes. It's like no if it's hardly ever or not at all. All right, more attention to detail. I often make small mistakes in my work. I skim reading. I tend to rush things. I mess up dates, get numbers wrong, or fail to notice, notice typos. I often overlook details in filling out forms. Forget to add attachments to emails. Yeah, pretty much. I forget shit all the time. But that doesn't mean anything. I'm easily distracted. I find it difficult to stick to longer tasks, even leisure activities. I may go off to do something else or I end up doing things several times at once. I struggle to follow through on complex tasks. Short deadlines work best for me. Yeah. Let's see. Um, for me, I never had a problem with difficult tasks and longer tasks, to be honest. Um, now it turns out that thing to our praising Lord. Um, I already got a overnight shift work, so I'm pretty much, you know, as a server, I don't think it's gonna be that hard. So if you guys really want to comment down below, um, if those of you who work as a server, what do you guys think? You know, working as a server is that hard? It's not that hard. I just really want to know. But maybe I'm just gonna get the experience because I'm still on training. Well, pretty much that annoys all my friends because they never ever stick to what I say I was gonna do. But I, you know, I don't mean or listener. I find I'm easily distracted during long conversations. I tend to tune out. I may be looking at someone, but I'm lost in thought. My mind often wanders. Well, okay, but who doesn't that apply to? Uh, wait, oh shit, I messed it up. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let you know. If it's about bitches talking about their guys and such and such, I'm really totally be like walking off, um, walking out and, and go somewhere else to do. Like, I fucking hate it. Like, I really do. So pretty much I got distracted by something that avoids you know the conversation one of them um oh gee though i think i went literally went off okay here it is and then pretty much but other than that i don't think uh see and end up a several on ones i struggle to follow the complex now i don't think so I struggle to follow through on complex tasks. Short deadlines work best for me. Yeah, pretty much. That annoys all my friends because they never ever stick to what I say I was going to do. But I, you know, it doesn't mean or 
listener. I find I'm easily distracted during long conversations. Oh, here it is. I may be looking right at someone, but I'm lost in thought. My mind often wanders. Well, okay, but who doesn't that apply to? These are like general, like, horoscope questions. Don't follow instructions. I prefer to jump right in rather than read through instructions, guides, or recipes. <laughs> I don't have regular routines at work at home. I struggle with schedules or plans. I'm not being obstinate. I know what to do. I just can't seem to do it. Oh, yeah. I, every single Ikea furniture package I've ever opened, I never look at the instructions until it's too late. I feel disorganized. God, do not look at my my, my apartment right now. Do I not have trouble earning an easy. chaos. Of my life. I create long to-do lists and then find them overwhelming. Plan well, that one will definitely say yes. Procrastinate because I can't see where to start to figure out what I need. Well, yeah, but now I feel bad because I've been answering yes ever. I mean, I know I have it, but it doesn't need to prove it so succinctly. Uh -oh, I avoid something tasks that require screen. sustained mental effort. Sorry. I struggle to finish things that demand a lot of focus for a long period of time. Other times I get in the zone and hyper-focus. I avoid routine tasks that feel monotonous, repetitive, or boring. When faced with a big, important task, I will do a bunch of trivial chores instead. I hate paperwork. Now, mm. see, this is where I can actually say no. I love a project that is monotonous to all hell. Like digging a hole in Minecraft or working on a big-ass compilation. Like, I like doing that. It's only starting it. It's only starting that gets me a problem. But once I'm in, I am in. I am laser-focused. Hmm. I love that. So I'm gonna say no. Often lose things I need. Oh, God. I... But once again, in the mess of my apartment, don't look over there, but it's a goddamn mess. Everything is chaos. Yeah. I'm easily distracted <laughs> by conversation, noises, or activities happening around me. I'm often lost in thought. My mind will be far away imagining interesting ideas, situations, or conversations. I'm pretty smart, but a bit absent-minded. I've been called a daydreamer. Oh, yeah, right up. Complimenting up my own ass about how smart I am. Well, yes, I'm a genius, but yeah, I'm distracted. Forgetful. I often lose track of what I'm supposed to be doing or what I've already done. God, I'm the worst. I'm so forgetful. Wow, he Leave. does has uh yeah, me. All right. So that was the first half. How'd I do? Your total is eight out of nine. A score of five or higher suggests inattention is a problem for you. While most people struggle with some of these symptoms, that doesn't mean they have ADHD. They could be stressed by major life events or any number of medical issues. See? Doesn't have to be anything. We're gonna look at hyperactivity next. Now I don't think I don't think I have hyperactivity because I, I believe I was diagnosed with ADD, not ADHD. But we shall see. Go to part two. You probably don't bounce around like a hyperactive child, but perhaps you feel often restless, driven, like there's a dynamo inside of you. Maybe you're impatient, on the go, thoughts race, sometimes tumbling. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I remember also, um, my, um, my cousin, well, my cousin, cousin, it, Definitely have a hyperactive, like literally. I remember one time we were doing a uh, sleepover, and I was sleeping right between the two. Of course, nothing goes wrong, and I was just literally sleeping. Nothing happened until I literally felt a punch in my fucking face. I was hurting so bad. I was like, "Ow!" I woke up, and it was his cousin, cause like his cousin literally shaking off so bad like a seizure and i scared the hell out of him until he fucking kicked me and i literally got knocked down until i woke up in the morning that the cousin the cousin's you know cousin he woke up like nothing happened got up all happy and shit and all that stuff and i'm like literally woke up and i'm like my face were so, like, not happy at all. I was like, what's going on? I said, I'm not going to sleep with, with the cousin cousin anymore. You know, he hurt me. And she saw, like, the next day, all that purple and shit. Never, ever. Oh, uh, that is why I'm... Fuck yeah, that sounds awesome. Physically restless, fidgety. I grow fidgety during meetings, classes, and church. church. I can become angsty, antsy during long conversations. Yes. <laughs> I'm the worst person. Oh my god. Actually, no. I've never been one to do this. I've never been one of the foot tapper. Like, things like that. Repetitive things. And just like, antsy nature. In my church, definitely. I am the most patient guy in the world. So I'm actually, no, on this one. I feel the need to get up on and move. Oh yeah, this one is me. Because when I'm watching a movie or anything like that, I have to be standing. Like, everyone else in the room can be sitting, but I have to be standing and pacing around. Like, I just, I have to do that. 
Restless. I'm impatient or agitated when things are quiet. I feel rushed, pressured, or driven. Oh, snap. Don't tell me I got it because I really hate it when it's so quiet. Yep, I do, I say, in my new apartment. Difficulty enjoying leisure activities quietly. I find it hard to relax or work quietly. Small talk is boring. I always have to be trying new things or changing them up. Yeah. Always pushing the envelope, tweaking and adjusting. God, I am... My light, the reason why my background and my lighting setup changes so much is because I fiddle with it all the time. Everyone gets on my case about it. I am a fiddler. I love fiddling. Oh, oh my god. For the top center of attention. Some would say I'm a bit immature, prone to drama. Everything's a big deal with me. Hey! No! Alright, it all sounds like I'm going to go driven by a motor. I'm drawn to one hobby or obsession after another. I have more stamina and enthusiasm. Well, not a mortar, but, uh... I find interesting, I dive in whole hog like a whirling dervish with tons of energy, but then suddenly crash. I'm more of a sprinter than a marathoner. Yeah, that's me. I dive in so hard. Like, the last time I got completely obsessed with something, I started a YouTube channel. And now I'm feeling the same way about music, and I'm not... Ah, I'm being very hesitant about it. Not really. Oh. <laughs> I always have lots to say, but I'm not so great at listening. I can be an enthusiastic chatterbox who can't stop. If someone else tries to speak, I get louder because I feel pressure to get it out. I what? I dominate conversations, telling great stories, but rarely learning anything about anyone else. I always have to top or match someone else's story. Now, well, I mean, to be honest, um, <laughs> uh, I am a literally a person who likes to get along with people by the fact that, uh, I get like, it literally like the most thing that I really do is get along with um anger angry people like person who not in their mood at all. I just keep fucking smiling and then be like, uh, I'm about to see, I'll, I'll bring the cops. I mean, there's nothing bad about it. <laughs> oh man, I'm bad. Um, just keep keep going. See? You may think that I would say yes to this, but actually, in personal conversation, I am the opposite. I love listening. I love engaging in conversation, but I have a great mind to share and not just dominate the conversation. Like, I'm a good speaker. I am. I'm a great public speaker, and I love the sound of my own voice. But don't get me wrong. In normal one-to-one -one conversation, like, I'll listen more than I'll say. So mm. I'm blurting out. I'm full of ideas. My mind jumps ahead and races. Oh, and yeah, that's me. Oh, so shoot. I offer one idea or opinion after another. I may seem impatient or dominating, always adding my two cents. Having to contribute my ideas, and I have lots of them. I'm instantly enthusiastic and interested in new challenges. I say yes to everything and then end up overwhelmed with commitments. Now I'm like, <laughs> not, not. I'm not one to just blurt out every idea in my mind in certain sessions like brainstorming sessions you need that but i'm actually reserved until i have an idea that i think the, is the only Maybe thing i could say so is I'm never saying, splurt out your, your dreams to could become true because the envy will take over you one checkout line to another seeking the fastest cashier well who doesn't do that i'll go out of my way to avoid slow traffic well okay oh, cool. or long conversations i can't stand people who speak slowly small talk is painfully boring Friend who asks the waitress about every item on the menu makes me go crazy. I hate waiting for other people to arrive. I can't just sit back and realize. Well, this is like an everybody question. Who wouldn't answer yes for this? I interrupt and intrude on oh, others. Wow. I interrupt, chime in, or intrude into other people's conversations. I'm gonna go ahead and know. I've already answered this. I don't do that. That's bullshit. That's rude. That's rude. I got manners. That's rude. What am I? Am I totally ADHD? Your total score for hyperactivity and impulsivity is five out of nine. The threshold is five predominantly combined subtype of ADHD. Okay, what does that mean? Since you scored a five or more in part one, this suggests you may have what is called predominantly combined subtype of ADHD. This is the most common type of ADHD. I don't know what that means, but it sounds like it's a bunch of bullshit, but this test online must be long. <laughs> so there goes my fate. I have ADHD. What a revelation this is. I got Damn. a doctor who diagnosed me for ADHD that I have ADHD according to this thing on the internet. But either way, this is a bullshit test online. <laughs> anyway, these questions are kind of interesting, even though they seem pretty broad. You know what? So, Let me see you, if I can ADHD literally, there, um, just know it's okay. You're gonna get through take the test. Fine. Let's try to take a fucking test. How about that? Like, I want to take a test for me, though. Oh, look. Oh. There's here it is. So let's go ahead and take a test. I want to take the test myself. Um, I understand. Blah, blah, blah. And then, okay, here we go. 
I have to smell small mistakes in my work. I, well, yeah, I do. I tend to rush things. Um, not exactly. I messed up dates. No, get numbers wrong. Depends. <laughs> and or fail to notice typos. Um, not exactly. Um, well, I mess up dates. No, I ruin dates. That's what I am. Um, I often overlook details and fill in all forms. Well, okay, the only thing I do will fuck it up is the the names, the address, and the emails. So, let's say, yes, I will fucking have a problem. Next. Can you go next or something? Answering this question is... Oh, no, I didn't see that. I have a difficulty stick or longer task. Oh. Oh, no, it's too put no. Next. Uh, I found easily distracted during longer conversations. Yes. <laughs> I just look around. Uh, following instructions. Write in. Jump in, write in. Rather than reading. Guys, I remember recipes. And then I don't have regular routine at work or at home. Okay, to be honest, I didn't do shit home. So I'm like, okay, whatever. Oh, she'll do. Okay, this is organized. I have I do have a problem because I Okay, whatever. Um I avoid tasks that require sustenance and mental effort. Let me see. How mental effort is that shit is? I struggle finishing things and I'm in a lot of focus for a longer time. Or then sometimes and get in zone hyper focus. I avoid routine tasks and feel my monstrous repetitive boring. And I face with big important tasks I will try them. Oh, I hate paperwork. Not exactly. Uh, okay, so let's say loosen things. Oh, yes, my, I lost a lot of shit. Okay. Um, yeah, I lost last time. I lost the uh, my keys one time where I had to stay outside for a fucking two hours straight. Um, what else I lost? Oh, and I regretted I left my fucking, um, my fucking bear to this guy and I, um, we were trying to work things out which basically is not going to happen in the future um even though he doesn't know it but whatever uh what's next um is it distracted um let's say how distracted is noises i'm easily distracted by okay um no not exactly but i am most distracted for everybody uh next um forgetful pack something i have to go back i um, I'm bad with names. Yes. <laughs> I'm bad with names. As soon as I said that, I'm like, yes. Okay. Uh, six out of nine. Your score or higher suggests that inattention is a problem for you. Okay, whatever. It's going to go part two. Begin part two. Um, Meeting classes. Oh my god. Yes, most definitely. Like I said, I f I don't have food, but I freaking fall asleep. That's that's what I do. Um, I feel needy to get up and move. Um, sometimes, but yeah, sometimes. Restless. I'm impatient when I things are quiet. Most definitely. Um, difficulty in enjoying leisure's activity quietly. Uh, finding work to relax and work quietly. Um, yeah, to be honest, because when I clean, some, like, when I, sometimes when I clean my room, I, um, mostly, I put music on. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna about to clean in a bit, and I'm gonna start putting in fucking music. Whatever. I always go to Driven. Um, are you drawn into one hobby or obsession after another? It has more stamina. Eh, whirly, nah, I don't think so. Uh, not rude, but talkative. Yeah, I am. Oh, shit. Um, okay, as a mortar? No. Wait. Not rude, but talkative. Okay, that's... that's. Congrats, you completed the... Oh, wait, what? Blurring out. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, blurring out. My mind just raises a head. Mm, lots of them. And I'm enthusiastic and interested in new challenges. Oh, yes, I am. 
Uh, waiting my turn is frustrating. No. Interrupt and in, in I interrupt and intrude, intrude on others. No, not exactly. I respect everybody's opinions. Okay, since you also have a score five and part five or more in part one, you suggest you have a, what it called a. You know what? Fuck you. Yeah, I'm not gonna believe that shit. Whatever. Uh, what the other people says about this damn quiz? Is that a butt? <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, pretty much that's how I, you know, see it. And I, uh, I watch other shit here that I, um, pretty much more chance to share. But um, yeah, that's, I'm just gonna leave you guys here. I don't want to take too much time and everything. Furries, really? What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with the world? <laughs> uh, spider prank. I really am watching like random shit today cuz I'm I'm relaxing cuz I got out from training. Yeah. Anyway, I got to go because I have to finish cleaning and uh hopefully you guys give me a like and uh pretty much uh put in the comments down below to be honest what else should I play? I mean, I have no other shit to do. Also, I'm going to show you guys that I have done these videos lately. Uh it's pretty cool. I don't know this one. I have no audio this little part here. And this one I already fixed it and I already got the audio now. And also the goodest thing is that I already got my thing back. So go ahead and check those out. And, and even though I know that I play the other one, the Rollins, Rollins guy. But it's by the fact that it's just for fun and I like the music especially. And hold on, I will show you something. Hold on, I will show you something cool. Um, pretty, like, pretty much this is what, like, all I do is playing games through phone and through computer, as many as, you know, as I can for you guys. Watch this. <laughs> well, to be honest, I never was back. So, KFP, um, KFP. Okay, yeah, it is. Anyway, so, I'll let you guys here, and, um, hopefully you guys are enjoying today. So, yeah, alright, um, I gotta go. Have a great night.